Never use the hashtag FYP in your TikTok videos. Like never. I know that people feel like that this is an amazing strategy to get your video, your views, like video seen by more people, go viral and all that, but that's not the case. And today in this video, I'm going to talk to you about why you should never use the hashtag FYP and what you actually should do. All right. So on TikTok, you know, FYP stands for For You page. And that is the page where people are, or you are seeing content of people that you don't know. So there's the following page where you see people that only that you follow. And then there is the FYP. And so we all know that you can use different hashtags to target people. And so people feel like, or there's this like rumor or whatever, that if you use the hashtag FYP or, or, or hashtag for you or hashtag for you page, that your video is going to go viral and be seen by more people. Well, here's the deal. Like when you create a piece of content on the TikTok platform, you have an idea who you want to see the content. Like if you are... 50 years old and the people that normally enjoy your comment or your content or your humor are in their 40s, 50s, and 60s, then the last thing you're going to want to try to do is to get everybody in their 30s, 20s, and under watching your content. Because we all know that the watch time is everything, meaning that your goal is to get people to watch your entire video, maybe even loop the video and then comment and want to, you know, engage with you and follow you and all the things. Well, in that case, it's really important for you to make sure that you are targeting your content to your particular audience. When you use the hashtag FYP, here's what happens. Like hashtag anything. When you use a particular hashtag, what you are telling TikTok is send this piece of content to anybody that has used that particular hashtag. And then in my feed, when I'm scrolling, I want you to send me all the content of people that are using that same hashtag. Let's just say you use the hashtag tacos, right? And you're like, you just use the hashtag tacos. But what you're going to find is that you're going to start receiving content in your FYP feed of people talking about tacos or using a hashtag tacos. And you might say, what is going on? Why is my feed looking like this? You're thinking that the algorithm is messed up. No, it is what you're doing, you know, in your videos. So when you use the hashtag FYP, you have literally told TikTok, send this video to anybody that has used the hashtag FYP or has interacted with content using the videos FYP, but also send the, all the FYP content it to me on my FYP feed. You do not want to do that, right? You just don't. It's like I am a marketing and TikTok strategist, right? And so the people that we typically serve in my business is female coaches, female course creators, or what have you. So I'm not going to use the hashtag FYP because I, everybody is not going to be interested in my content. It's going to be female business owners, female business coaches, female course creators, right? Uh, things of that nature. And so when I'm using particular hashtags, I am trying to reach my intended audience. Sometimes I will talk about how I went through divorce and bounce back. And I want that content to reach divorcees to encourage them, motivate them and all the things. And so I will use the hashtag divorce, divorce, TikTok, over 30 divorce, uh, um, divorce over 40 or whatever. And so then in the comment section of my video, then I will have all of these people commenting that have gone through divorce, right? Now that does mean that I'm going to get content in my feed of divorcees, but I already know that going in, okay? So if you're wanting to get more views, more like comments and engagement from your right people, then using the FYP hashtag is not the way. It's just not the way. Like, just think about it. When's the last time you use the hashtag FYP and you're like, you're looking at your feed like, what is going on? Why do I have all this stuff in my feed? It's because you told the algorithm to send you all that stuff. And that, oh my God, I, I, listen, I see people all the time on TikTok that say, TikTok, you're, you know, algorithm, da, 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 da. and I'll look in their videos and I'll see the hashtag FYP. I saw somebody like that a couple of weeks ago and I commented and said, you've got to stop using FYP. And she was just like, is that the reason? And I'm like, yeah, but I know if someone's new to TikTok, they may not understand that, which is why I'm here to be able to help you. So I hope that you have found this video valuable and that you will start, you know, 
using a marketing strategy uh, to grow your account on TikTok. Now, if you are saying to yourself that you want help with TikTok, two things. One, we do do consulting and there's a link in the description if you want to do some one-on-one consulting. Two, we do have some courses that really walk you through all the things of TikTok, how to market your business and make money on a TikTok platform. And also we do a TikTok account management where you are able to just record the videos that we give you the scripts to and then be done, right? We will upload and edit the videos and we will do all the comments for you. So either way, if you want to do TikTok account management, one of our courses or consulting, just click on the link in the description and you will see that. And we look forward to working with you.